A day after the horrific Peshawar attack, Pakistan's terror doublespeak has been exposed. 2611 key conspirator Zakir Rahman Lakhvi has been granted bail by a Pakistan court. So while the Pakistan government passes the buck saying the decision was made by the courts, India cries foul and demands that the Pakistan government take serious action against the 2611 perpetrators. آج ہماری قومی قیادت نے عظم اور استقلال کے اسی عہد کو دوراتے ہوئے یہ تیہ کیا ہے کہ مکمل عظم اور یکسوئی کے ساتھ اس جنگ کو اس وقت تک جاری رکھیں گے جب تک ہماری سرزمین پر ایک بھی دہشتگرد باقی ہے It didn't even take 24 hours to expose Nawaz Sharif's farcical response on fighting terror. Because the man who was responsible for butchering 164 people in the 2611 attacks walks out of jail. This after the Pakistan government failed to oppose Lashkar terrorist Zakiur Rahman Lakhvi's bail plea. There were witnesses who were saying that this was the training camp and so it transpired that entire information and their testimony, it was based upon hearsay. So far as court of law is concerned, court always see and decide the case on the basis of evidence. So far as allegation and assumption, assumptions are concerned, same has nothing to do in the court of law. No legally admissible evidence is available in this regard. The insufficient evidence excuse falls flat in the face after the long list of confessions by David Headley that clearly identifies Zakiu Rahman Lakhvi as the man who planned, financed and executed the carnage in Mumbai. While Ajmal Amir Kasab clearly identified Lakhvi as the man who played the most important role in executing the 2611 attacks. evidences पाकिस्तान गवर्नमेंट को प्रोवाइड किए गए थे मुंबई की आतंकवादी वारदात के मुलजिम को बेल ग्रांड किया जाना इसे मैं बहुत ही दुर्भाग्यपूर्ण मानता हूं द इंडियन गवर्नमेंट रबिश द पाकिस्तान गवर्नमेंट्स डिफेंस एंड आल्सो क्वेश्चन पाकिस्तान्स इंटेंट इन ब्रिंगिंग द गिल्टी टू बुक वी कॉल अपॉन द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ पाकिस्तान टू इमीडिएटली टेक स्टेप्स टू रिवर्स दिस डिसीजन there can be no selective approaches to terrorism. The death of 132 children in Peshawar has reminded Pakistan of the dangers of a short-sighted approach to tackle terrorism. But as Lakhvi walks free, it looks like Pakistan has still not learned its lessons, while India awaits justice for 2611. Bureau Report, Times Now.